begin tonight with devastation in Dearborn after a crash claimed the life of a doctor. Thank you for joining us for 7 News Detroit at 6. I'm Mike Duffy. And I'm Glenda Lewis. Police say another driver ran a red light causing the fatal accident. It happened around 8 this morning in the area of Michigan Avenue and Nolan Street. 7 News Detroit's Darren Cunningham spoke with a man who heard the crash and tried to help. He shares a message for everyone who has the privilege to drive. A makeshift memorial here on Michigan Avenue in Dearborn marks the spot where a 33-year-old woman, a beloved doctor here in Dearborn, lost her life this morning. I'm here 10 hours a day, six days a week. I've been here for 30 years, so I've seen it all. Omar Mahajer, owner of Hudson's Cleaners on Michigan Avenue near Nolan Street, says today started like any other day. He was standing at the counter with his coffee, waiting for customers. But then the unthinkable happened just before 8 a.m. She was at that light going north, that F-150, and the lady was speeding coming down eastbound and hit a T-bone it and dragged her right over here with the intersection where the flower is right now. Someone came, put him up. He called 911 and ran to help. I couldn't open the truck. Mohajer says he then ran to the SUV driven by the at-fault driver, a 26-year-old woman from Taylor who police say was driving excessive speeds and had run a red light. We pulled the lady out. We left her on the ground. Then I went back to the F-150 trying to open, see what's going on with the lady. Uh, still, we cannot open the door up. I tried to talk to her. She's not respond. Dearborn police say the 33-year-old woman, the innocent driver of the F-150, died on scene. A mother and beloved doctor from Dearborn who friends identify as Dr. Gada Mustafa. Mahajir has a message for everyone behind the wheel. I ask everybody to slow down because that lady was literally driving 90 miles an hour. Better be late than sorry. If you're going somewhere, you're late five minutes, 10 minutes, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. Look no what happened. Time. You took her life away. She's married, she had three kids, she's a doctor. I mean, the whole community is devastated with this tragic accident. That's why we urge everybody to slow down. Take it easy. At last check, the driver of the SUV is in critical condition. No word yet on charges. In Dearborn, Darren Cunningham, 7 News Detroit. Sad story, Darren. Thank you for the update there.